Hi everyone. Today I am going to discuss about the neem toothbrush. Neem tree, that is Margosa tree, is commonly seen in southern Asia. It grew in dry land. Its bark, seeds, leaves are used for the medicinal purposes. Neem has very good antimicrobial activity, so helps to maintain the oral hygiene and it's having bitter and astringent taste and cold potency as for the medicinal users. So which will help to maintain the health of the gum. Neem is used in the preparation of soaps, toothpaste, cosmetics and as well as as a plant protectant. In India, it's used to consume in a little quantity also in the festivals like Yugadi and all. Seeds are used to prepare the oil, bark is used to prepare the powder and leaves are used to prepare the juice out of it. In this video, I am going to discuss how to use a small twig of the neem as a toothbrush. Acharya Vagbata while describing Dhinacharya, that is daily regimen, he has told that Kani Negra Samastavalyam, the thickness of the twig which we take for the, the toothbrush should be have a thickness as that of the little finger of the user. Mrudvagram Kashaya Katu Tiktakam Mrudvagram means the tip which you are using as a brush. You should have a soft brush. We have to make it soft. Kashaya Katu Tiktakam The drugs which we use as a toothbrush, the drug should have either Kashaya Katu Tikta Rasa means taste. So either you should have astringent, pungent, or bitter taste. So this Nimba or Margosa is having astringent and bitter taste. Tanta Mamsa no Bahadarya brushing method be in such a way that you should not injure the teeth and gum. Many times I use Margosa twig as my toothbrush. Apart from bitter taste and no frothing, rest all remains same. This is the natural and healthy way of brushing. And people who are residing in the cold area for them it's difficult to get the neem twig so i'll give the link in my description so you can get it from the amazon also so this is all about the neem brushing thank you thanks for watching my video